vlog two guys welcome back to the channel if you're new here then hello thank you for tuning into my holiday vlog we are in turkey currently in marmaris i've just got ready it's day four here so if you haven't watched the first part of the trip you should definitely tune into that vlog too but it is approximately half past 10 we are really not early risers on holiday to be honest i think we're just we're two hours ahead so we've been waking up at like six english time eight turkey time and we've just been having like slow mornings or whatever but i've just got myself ready um, this is the outfit. I'll show you properly outside, but I've just gone for like a neutral fit. We're just going to have a day at the pool today, chill, and then this evening it's white night. So we're probably going to go and explore the town a little bit. We've got a boat trip tomorrow. But yeah, I thought I'd just come on and say good morning. Ollie's just making us a ginseng, ginseng or ginseng? Ginseng, I think. Ginseng tea. It's like good for energy and whatever. It's like a Turkish tea. So we brought some last night. And we had the apple last night and we're going to have the ginseng, which the man also called sex tea. Um, but it's basically just good for energy. He says that they tend to have it like in the mornings here, like sort of their alternative to coffee. So I've just sprayed this. This is the scent. It's so good. I feel like it's just, it doesn't last a long time, but it's just a nice like refreshing holiday scent. Um, I'm just going to get ready, jewellery wise. I'm just going to put in these hoops. This hat, by the way, is from Sheen. I'm just going to put these really cute hoops in from Primark. Primark have honestly slayed the holiday um, jewellery this year. Like, I've got the cutest things from Primark. Absolutely living for it. I'm going to put these in. I need to brush my teeth. Brush it after I've had my tea. Um, I can't get my hair wet today because I washed it last night, so... A bit annoying. Does it taste nice? Yeah. Here we go, guys. Cheers to holiday. Vlog too. Oh, it smells good. Oh, it's nice. Mmm. Tastes fruity, doesn't it? Yeah. I'm also going to add these bangles from Primark. I've still got my all inclusive wristband on. Ollie's took his off. And I feel like if anyone should have took them off, it's me, because it's really not the vibe in the back of Instagram photos, but I've just been keeping them, keeping it in. Um, I think I'm going to double up my hoops, maybe with these ones from Primark. My whole, oh, and these shorts are from Primark too. Uh, do they look cute or a bit much? We'll just go for it, hey. My hair will be up, so it will look boring. Anyway, I will pick you guys up downstairs, but I just wanted to say good morning. I hope you guys are well. Get excited for the rest of the vlog. It's going to be a fun ending. We've got a boat trip. My brother comes on the weekend. Um, yeah, so the last holiday vlog, but it's going to be a good one. So get comfy, get a cup of tea, get a nice coffee. I'm really missing the iced coffees because they don't do them at their hotel. And I really want to go and find one. So maybe we'll go and find one this morning. I just want an iced coffee with some caramel syrup. The fine dark skies. What, what did you get? What did you get? What did you get? Ooh. The fine dark skies. This is the fit. Back to my new start. So you such a loser. Back to what? It's playing that football game. You know the football game that I've got as well. Guys, we just went to the pharmacy because Archer's got a bit of a blocked ear. Um, it's really hurting him so he just popped to the pharmacy but it's 37 degrees it's not even 12 o'clock there's like a sign here with the temperature on and um, last night when we were eating dinner it was 31 degrees and it dropped to 30 about half 11 and it's now 37 but i feel like you can add a few degrees on that anyway um but this is the outfit i don't know if i showed you we're gonna go back to the pool is what i put them in it's three drops four times a day it's really friggin' hot isn't it and then this is our hotel, this is like the strip that it's on. It's probably like a mile or so out of Marmaris. Go. I know, we were saying no one really stops. They're like zebra crossings, but people don't actually stop. They just carry on, but we got lucky on that trip and it stopped both ways. Hair has gone off. I'm starving, but I will see you guys. It's white night angels. Hate my hair. Obviously it's a good hair day. 
Oh. <laughs> I don't like that. Well, this is my outfit today. Stradivarius top, new look trousers, go bag, gold jewellery on hair. Ollie's also in white. So we'd meet him by the bar. Hi Arch! Happy white night! We're just going to the shop to get a dessert because the food, the food's not really it. Snack of the evening guys, M&M's, crispy always, tell me different. What's the other one? Peanut and... Peanut and what's the other one? Chocolate. This is the goat. Lolly got. Harry Bells! We're gonna have some drinks, play cards, just have some family fun. Take a look out the window. Spirit goes up as the rain falls down. I've been sitting on the wrong course. Keep it together like I did before. Think that I've said this a few times. Even with that, has it ever felt right? You know it must be hot if the hair goes up. Guys, we're literally sweating when we outside, but it's just too hot, so we've come into the lobby to play cards. Let me know what your favourite um, card game is, like what's your family's go to. Ours is just pretty much fours and threes, go fish, whatever you guys like to call it. Also, like um, Chase the Ace, it's a good one to see, and also Bullshit, but, but that's more. Um, of course it's a good game to be fair, maybe we'll play that, but yeah, me, Archie and Olive just come in, they're just getting me a drink, this is the look, it's really cute. One thing about Tokyo hotels are they're always like really grand like this, and um, we were just out there, sat like, but yeah, the hotel's really big. To be fair, it's quite a big um, resort, but yeah, we're going to sit here, the curls just completely dropped, um, but my hair because it's just so hot, so yeah. The, I don't know if I told you my outfit details, Stradivarius top, new look trousers, love these trousers and I've seen a lot of other um, Zebra trousers today. It, like I think it's because it's a classic white night, you know, little black and white trouser, white crop, sitch, so we love that. What did you get? Three waters and one apple. Aww. What did I get? Thank you. It's way better in here. Wait till you sit down, how comfy. How nice. We are back in the room guys and one thing about me and all is we love the snack. So we went to the shop and got these ruffles. They don't have like a salt and vinegar other than Pringles and I don't really like Pringles salt and vinegar. The telly's on, I don't know where the remote is. So I got cheese. I didn't really want to get original, low key boring. So we got some ruffles, we're going to sit in bed and eat these. What time is it please? Kind sir. Quarter past eleven. Quarter past eleven. Early so we've been in the room, but we've got to be up in the morning and we've got to be at the excursion desk, which is only next to the hotel, but we've got to be there for 9 a.m. So we haven't been waking up. I mean my alarm went off this morning at eight. And I think I got up, but then yesterday it went off at eight and I slept for another like hour or so. So hopefully we get up. What time should we get up? What time have we got to get up? What time? We've got to be at breakfast. We've got to be at the excursion desk for nine. Uh, I would say I want to be up at about 8 o'clock. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to get up at half seven then. I like to get up a little bit before roll so I can get myself ready and not feel rushed. So I like we're not in the bathroom, like, you know, fighting over the toothpaste, fighting over the euphemol. Uh. Sad. But we've got a tea and also the maid didn't replace our cup so we had to chop. A plastic cup in half. Don't say we're not bougie. Don't say it's a bit hot still. We're living really, hot life. We are living the hot life. It's really hot on your fingers. That's what I said. So we've got a tea. We're going to sit and eat our crisps. The only... Oh, I think it's like 24 hours in a or something. The only channels we've got are ITV... Oh, we, maybe ITV too. We'll Love Island be on. We're not even watching Love Island, but it's better than what we've had to watch. <gasps> Love Island's on! And it's got sound. Yeah, ITV2, the sound went yesterday. If you haven't even been watching Love Island, let me know. Who are these people? Ooh. Oh, I wish we were watching it now. Yeah. Love Island is nice to watch in the world, isn't it? It is, because like, 
it makes you feel like you're at home a little bit. Aww. Okay, right, guys, we're gonna watch this and I'll see you in the morning. Cheers to that. <laughs> My hand's burning. Good morning, besties. It is 8 a.m. I'm so tired. I just can't get to sleep early here. Like, we just stay up so late, and I just, I don't get why. Like, I don't get what. <laughs> we were literally watching Love Island, which finished at 10, so 12 here. Um, and then I tried to go to sleep, but it was probably like half 12. Um, and then I just kept waking up in the night. I think because I knew I had to be up and I thought my mum would kill me if I sleep in. So I'm just going to get ready. I'm going in with the St. Moritz face tan serum. And it's a really, it doesn't really add like a colour, but it adds a really nice glow. And I think it just naturally, it's like a bit of a gradual tan. So I've just been putting it on. But it does add a really nice glow in the mornings. Also, I put on the. One sec. I just wipe my hand so I don't go fringe. I put on the um, St. Moritz as well, their daily tanning moisturiser last night. Um, just to see if it gave me any colour. And I do think maybe. I mean, I obviously have caught the sun too, but this bikini is from Sheen. I really like this one. I, think, I feel like this bit's really firing. So, that's that. Um, and then. The only other thing I'm going to put on is a little bit of this Kylie Skin um, eye cream. Just a little bit. This again is a really nice glowy. Eye cream. You don't need a lot. That I was putting so much on before. And it just like spreads so much that so you only need a tiny bit. Love. Okay, and then we're gonna go in with our SPF. Um, I've been go away. Um, I've been liking this one. Um, this is obviously the tinted version. I don't know if I've just put the tinted one on. Yeah, I'm, I don't know where the other one is. Let's just go with this one. And I also have been really enjoying that Garnier one, guys. I think though that. It hurts when your face gets wet, but I think all sun creams hurt when it goes in your eyes. So this was nice because it has like a very slight sheer. And we're talking sheer, but sheer coverage. But my face, I feel like it's always the last to tan. I don't know why. Holly says that that is just what faces do. Right, I'm going to clear my teeth. Um, where's my toothpaste? I just need to brush my brows up. I'll use YLA and then literally just add a little bit of Laneige and a little bit. Um, what was I going to say? I, I'm also, what I've been putting on top of the Laneige is the Malibu lips. So I will see you guys in a bit. I'm going to go for breakfast and then we will be on the boat. I haven't been on a boat trip for a few years, I'm kind of excited. It's fun because they like take you to different stops, you get to jump off. Um, I think this one takes us to like a beach as well and apparently there's a really like authentic Turkish market there which I thought was so fun. So yeah, I'll see you guys in a little bit, but good morning, excited for another day in Turkey, so. Here we guys, we are on the boat. This is my bikini today, it is Sheen. We are just waiting to leave. It's so hot already, like we're literally all sweating, but um, I think when we move, is that us? No. When we move, I feel like the wind will come, so this is how it looks. Morning! <laughs> Morning! Morning! <laughs> we're all really tired, but I will show you when we're moving. I imagine we're going to go over there. <laughs> Recording? Oh, oh, go for it.
at home and the music's off so I can actually talk to you. We just, oh thank you, we've just got some chips. 100 lira chips. 100 lira chips. They give us sort, I don't know where. Uh, it's on the Them floor. chips cost you like three pounds. No, what that? Oh, thanks, mommy. Don't be back on it, sir. He give you salt. That's Ollie, not right, does it? Ollie, you give you salt. I know. I don't know where he put it. Thank you. Dad, can put I have the a chip, please? On too, babe. I don't Ke think that may look Ke right. Cap. Let me try it. Yes, the red chips. Just really. Gross. Can I have a chip, please, Dad? Can you... I don't want to knock the camera. Off. Thank you. Just have one. I'll show you the view. It's stunning. We jumped in like two times. We jumped in somewhere called Amos Bay, Amos Bay, and then we also just jumped in. I wouldn't eat the bay mum, it tastes horrid. It's like Tipex. That's what Tipex tastes like. Well, just what I imagine. I'm not in the video, am I? No, no. you can be. No. Ketchup's fine. Can I get more mayo, please? Silly That's a nice ketchup, that is. That is nice. It's like the Crushells one. Which I think, guys, is the top tier ketchup. Not Heinz, not HP. Crush is that what it's called, Old Crushels? Crushels. Crushels. The one that you see in like the chip shops, it's so good. I get it from B&M, I think. And Aldi also sometimes have it. It's a Lee and the garlic mayo from there. So this is us. Gonna cut to town and then I think we're stopping at the market next month. Mom. Stop at the market next. What's the market today? Come on. So I'll see you guys in a bit. I hope you've enjoyed the GoPro clips. I've really enjoyed filming them. I said I feel like a real, um, you know, videographer. I know, you know, we've really levelled up the channel. We're not amateurs anymore. We've got a GoPro. All thanks to me. All thanks to Arch. So how do we get the clips off? SD card? No. Ah. I've got the aftermath on. Brilliant, guys. Like transfer them over. Oh, okay. oh, he's bringing the food Sarah, over. Have you been eating it? Yeah. Not very many by the looks of it. Yeah. No, you can carry on. You're hungrier than me. Oh my god. Let's not let them in the stove. Yeah, that don't Oh, also, we've got these, and they're better than the ones at home. Here, say. They're Doritos and Nacho. Much cheesier, they're a bit more like what's it? Also, you've got a lace packet hanging Also what? <laughs> Are the lays nice, Mum? I haven't had any. Yeah. I've only had ruffles. Lovely. I love ruffles. Cheese and onion ruffles. Right, last one for you. No, you can finish that one. Oh, thanks. Oh, here's the salt. He dropped down my leg. I'm gonna make money, okay? It's only 20 quid. Put that in a bit more of your food. I'll bring it here, beg. Oh, he's got it. Thank you very much. This is good. We've got pasta, we've got chicken, we've got salad, we've cabbage and bread. Is it nice? Hi guys, we've stopped. Where are we, Mom? Mom, where are we? Turum. 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 T U R U M C. Oh, Turum. Turum. Okay. I'll show you guys. It's really pretty. Bloody hell. It's really hot. This is what we're looking at. There's the boat. We're on the Mamma Mia one. Archie and um, Andy are coming. Ollie's looking a gorgeous golden colour. That's what we're going to do. I think we're going to walk. I think there's a little market. We're going to have a little look around. Probably just sit and chill in the shade, to be honest, because it's just too hot to be out. Guys, I've joined the fan gang. I saw the women with them, and they look colder than I am, so I got this one. Hey, pretty, right? Hey, pretty. Ooh. So catchy, me like this now. I haven't quite got that. Oh, I'd love a bit of mint. Do they have shade to sit in? Let's go. 
Can I get one mint, please? Can mm -hmm. I get it in a um, cup? Medium large? At large, please. Large. Guys, I got mint, my favourite. Ollie got vanilla, is it nice? It's good, but this just cost us £10. Robbers. That was a big day. Oh, actually, I can put you over there. Wait. How about that? Let me just get my tea. What's new, bestie? We got a monster and also a little tea. Okay, so the boat we booked with a company that's literally next to our hotel. I don't know what the name is. I'd have to ask my mum. But if you come in, like, there's so many boats. But for reference, we got £20 for five, like, each for five or so. It's like £100. My mum and Andy paid an extra £5, I think, to have alcohol. Me, Ollie and Arch obviously didn't bother, um, but that just meant they got like beer, but it was unlimited soft drinks and then a lunch. And like you guys saw, we didn't have very high hopes for the lunch to be honest, because I thought it would just be a bit of nothing. It's disconnected me now. I'm trying to upload my Instagram stories, but it's disconnected me. They've all uploaded in a weird order, so sorry about that guys. And um, what was that, Barbie? Oh. So, yeah, that's how much it cost us, um, and that's what was included. So we got three swim stops, and then we also stopped at... No. Did we get two swim stops, or three? Three. Yeah, and then we also stopped at a town called T-U-R-U-N-C. Turunk. Turunk, I think it's actually pronounced. And that was a lovely town, but it was so hot. So when we were coming back, we looked at Watermere. We looked at one of the temperature things. Guys, guess how hot? 46 degrees it's four o'clock so i honestly think like in the day like when it's like it's hottest at like what 12 one o'clock it must be in the 50s which obviously explains why it's just too hot to actually even sit in like whenever we've been to turkey before you can actually sit in the um in the sun oh my god, oh my god, oh my god i wish you would have silenced it now it's so annoying um you can sit in the sun you just have to keep going in the pool but it's undoable like facts it's just too much so that's why we haven't really caught a ton other than my mum because she's a psycho in the sun so yeah that was the boat super fun and they have like a little dance on there there's music they go around with like chips other drink no no other drinks um crisps oh yeah there were slushies like little snacks that you can obviously pay for we've got some um chips for like 100 lira which is about three pound so that was a fun day um, and then we were waiting for the transfer to bring us back it was only about a five minute drive it was taking the piss to come so we just jumped in a taxi and we said oh like how much do i deal prime and he said 200 lira we said great that's like six pounds so we jumped in and then like when we got back he was like no i said 250 and we were like no you said 200 and um, he's a bit funny about it but i feel like they try don't they so we were like no <laughs> and he like walked up in a huff but i was like we, you literally said 200 multiple times um, so oh my god too hot to drink too hot to drink so that is what we're um, currently up to what else did I want to say I can't remember my shorts today were Miss Pap the white shirt's H&M the best white shirt I've ever brought it was like £20 I got it last year for Ibiza and I feel like I'll never have to buy another beach white shirt again like it's the best quality I got a medium it's nice and oversized it fits like you know if you like robbed your dad's shirt that's how it sort of fits um, and then yeah the shorts were Miss Pap had the ego slides on beach bags boohoo if I haven't already said so yeah that's the vibe we were gonna maybe go to the gym because it's only quarter to five but i feel like no we've got back to the room we've just crashed but we haven't been obviously ollie went to go the other day but he said it wasn't that good and it, it's not air con is it no <laughs> big no so yeah we'll probably just chill we're gonna go into marmaris tonight and have a um, meal just us i don't know where we're gonna go and i haven't said on my instagram where we're staying um i'll post like once we've well, obviously you'll know when this vlog goes live but it's the ideal prime beach in Marmaris there's two ideal ideal primes there's one a little bit of the road which my cousin stayed at last year I'm not sure what that one's called and then there's this ideal prime too um and one of you guys stayed there you messaged me and said oh my god I was there in June and I was like no way um so yeah we'll give you our full hotel one down I guess at the end of the vlog but we've still got two full days so my brother comes tomorrow afternoon and then we don't go home until half seven on Sunday. So we've still got a long way to go to get the bestie. So 
yeah i'll see you guys in a bit i'm gonna have a shower get ready this instagram story just isn't gonna upload it's such a refreshing 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 i've done it again put my feet up do you guys like ollie's feet so yeah that's it for me right now i will see you guys in a little bit and um, tea as always Okay, bye. Kiwi guys, I just got ready on the balcony. Here's my in the natural light. I'm going back into the aircon because that was so sweaty. Ollie has gone down stairs while I just filmed. Just he said he was gonna just sit at the bar. Aircon is on. Water is drank. Makeup's done. I'll show you. Did I show you guys my fan? I'm honestly obsessed with it. It cost me 60 lira, which is... Okay, so we class like a pound as about 30 lira. Um, they class it as like 35. So it's actually like not even two pound. It's stunning. I felt like such a cool bitch on the boat. Like, <laughs> this is it. How cute. And then on this side, it's like glittery. So yeah, I thought I would just update you. I'm ready. It, I don't know what time it is. I've looked at my phone, but I think I'm gonna leave my hair. It's sort of like beachy waves from being curled yesterday, and then obviously it's got wet today in the sea. But I thought, well, I'm not gonna wash it again. I think I'll just see this through and then probably go home with a hair mask in. Um, I don't know what to wear. We're gonna go into Marmara, so I don't know. It's gonna be sweaty, I'll say that. I've got a few options. I'm thinking either the House of Sunny Dupe from Sheen or this Boohoo Coord. Just because I've only got tonight and tomorrow evening left. So I'm thinking I want to get my best outfits out. And then obviously I've got that. Oh, I've got quite a few left. I, I did overpack. I know I'm like, I'm not going to overpack, but I did overpack. Mm. This is cute, but I'm just thinking walking around, am I going to get chafing on my flowers probably or i could do the green dress or this dress this is really cute it's just a bit big but to be fair i've been i feel quite bloated today so i might get away with this but i do want to put my hair in a bun for this so or that or i've got this which is really cute oh guys i facetime my brother and saw Sasha could have cried. I miss her so much. I said, please go and show me her. And Frankie, I was saying, Frankie. And she was going like this at the door, the front door, thinking I was there. I was like, don't, because I'll cry. Um, or I've got this cute skirt, which is giving Turkish. But all I've worn is white sliders and white bag all holiday. And I'm like, geez, Joan, like, let's add some other colour. But this would also be green slides. Mm. Decisions, hey? I'm thinking one of the dresses then. Should we do the green one and just put the hair in a bun? What's the worst that can happen really? It doesn't feel nice anyway. One sec, let's just see how we feel in it. If not, I'm gonna do the black and white one, I think. I'm a lucky girl. Oh, I'm gonna have to go to my mum though because she's got black sliders because I forgot black um, sliders. This cord, by the way, this little yellow cord is Zara, but really old, so I'd maybe, if you like it, I'd maybe check Vinted. Um, I got it like two years ago, so. See, it's a bit baggy around the boobs. It is really comfy, though. Mm. I'm not really obsessed, to be honest. What do you guys think? My hair's definitely going to have to go off. I don't really like my shoulders being out. Try the back one on. Oh, oh God, I feel like my hair is gonna have to go up, you know, because it's so hot. Every night I put my hair down, it goes back up. Did I tell you guys how hot it was? 46 degrees? Did I tell you that? This is lovely though. This fits so much better than the green one. How nice is this? It's from Sheen. This is a bit dodgy, the, the neckline, but. Um, what can I do with my hair that's cute? Okay, you guys are going to overheat because the, the inside of this camera is just so hot from that. What 
do we think? Do we even like it? This is such a hot decision. I do like it, it's just this is so weird here. And then do I do black bag and then go and get the sizes off my mum? I've got this black bag from Primark. Yeah, this looks cute actually, doesn't it? Okay, let me sort my hair out. Let's call you guys down because it's hot for you two. And then I will be back. Guys, I'm in the lift going in to meet all. I went for the dress. It's from Sheen, Primark bag. So I've got the white size on. I don't actually hate it, but I feel like I'm just going to run up to my mum's room and grab the black ones. Just I feel like I regret it not. But it's so hot. Got to put my rings on. Oh well. It's really hot. Oh god, this dress really rides up. Brilliant. Oh well, let's just go with it. The evenings here are gorgeous. We haven't really had like an intense sunset, you know, like the the purple and the pink and the orange but they're very like subtle i don't even know i think the sun was set further around so we just get like the end of it but yeah this is the fit anyway and i will catch you up with you guys when we're in marmaris dinner settings guys absolutely stunning look at the sunset it's called the han restaurant this is the menu We've got soups and starters, then hot starters, salad, pasta. I think it's awesome. I think I'm going to get a half and half pizza to share. Chicken noodles for me. What are you having? Lamb shank. Ollie's having lamb shank. Mm. It's really nice and it's not like, overpriced with that like, where it is. Okay guys, dinner is done. It was actually so good and I think so reasonably priced as well. Four one second, I'm just done. For the location, like it's right in the marina, but there's actually loads here. Um, like there's all the boats and then there's actually like this whole strip. But so good. The bill come to like 50. There's loads of cat kittens around here. The, the bill come to about 50 pounds, which I think is so reasonable. Obviously we had three mains. So my mum's coming and meeting us in about half an hour. So we're just going to walk, find some air con. I took the water from the restaurant because it's hot. Ollie's took his top off because it's hot. I'm sweating because it's hot. It is our last but one day. There's music on at the pool, obs, but I just wanted to check in and say hello. This is my bikini. It's from Sheen. It's so cute. And then how nice is this little setup I did for Sisters and Souls? Ellie's Creations, Marmara Shop, Bondi Sands, Lanage, Beach Essentials, girls. He's bringing me the goods. Thank you, darling. God, we're melty today. This is me. My brother's here. Oh, you tell us completely on me. You guys are definitely going to overheat. Feels like 50 degrees. I'll catch up with you when I'm at the room because it's just so hot and the music and everything. But 
Guys, we've got new snacks to try. We got this. This is a Nescaf Express vanilla coffee. I haven't had an iced coffee. There you go, doll. All week, so I am very desperate for this. Don't tell me how it is. We also got these lays. What flavour are they? Oh, sort of vinegar. Yeah. I thought they were like garlic and something. I like this open. Oh, it looks okay. Mm, you know what? I'll take it. Anyway, we're back to the room. It is six o'clock. We stayed at the pool a little bit later today because my brother didn't get here until like three. So we've just got back. We're meeting everyone at eight. So we've got just under two hours to i'm not gonna wash my hair but i'm just gonna go home with it with a hair mask in tom tomorrow so i'm gonna wet it have a shower get ready final night got so many outfits that i didn't wear but <laughs> we move with that and um, i'll pick you guys up in a little bit i'm just gonna chill drink this have a scroll on my phone and then let's head in the shower hello guys i feel like i've burnt my lips tonight i feel like i've caught the sun a little bit but today there was like more of a wind which is what we're used to so um we could sit in it for a little bit more but still not long let me show you my tan i feel like my lips started to burn when we were playing balls <laughs> i mean i've definitely got tan lines i feel like they'll show up more once i've had a shower but i'm not really going to get much darker now no point trying to burn or anything tomorrow um, but yeah, I changed into this bikini. I don't know if I told you. I thought this one was really cute, and I've got so many clothes that I haven't worn. So I thought I'm just gonna try and do outfit changes in the day. I'll do the same tomorrow because I'm not gonna be getting any more holiday content. Um, so I've got some weird film on the TV. I'm gonna jump in the shower. What else was I gonna say? Oh, guys, there's like wildfires in roads. Um, Ollie's youngest brother is in Rose and today he sent us like um, a picture on WhatsApp and you can do a boat trip from Marmaris to Rhodes. Um, when my grandma and granddad went to Rose a few years ago, well years ago, they got the ferry over to Marmaris for the day. I think it's like a long day but it's probably like a couple hours or something on like a boat you can go explore and then come back. Um, so it's not that far away but he, yeah he sent us a whatsapp video this morning and like there's like hills it's quite similar to what it's like here like big like hills and above it was this huge cloud like, it looks like a cloud but it's actually a cloud of smoke and like he got an emergency alert on his phone saying like if you're in these areas you must evacuate to like a different town so how crazy but I'm honestly not surprised because if it's as hot there as it is here I'm not actually surprised, but it's so scary, so we don't know exactly what he's doing, whether like the hotel move you, I don't really know, but I can imagine that's really scary. Um, so imagine it just spreads and like, what can they do? Do they like just let it die out? I don't know, but it's so warm, like, I, I don't really understand, but I was like, oh my God, I hope you like just be safe, like get out of the area. He's on holiday with his friends, so. Yeah, I was like, what the hell? Oh, and also let me get my phone. Who's done that kid thing, the AI with their kids? Let me go get my phone. Ollie's um, brother's girlfriend did this earlier. They're so cute. Because I tried to download the app. The app's called, if you want it, guys. It's Rem Remini. It's that one. But I see it's 39 degrees now. It says, but it's definitely probably hotter. The phone really lies. Like it said it was like 30 yesterday. And then the actual thing in the town said like 46. So, um... Yeah, I think I must have already downloaded it before because it's asking me to pay 9 99 a week and I thought, hell no, not to see my babies. But, oh, theirs won't load. But she did it for, oh no, it won't load. Her and Ollie's brother and then she did it for Ollie's other brother um, and girlfriend. And they actually look like it, but I'm sorry, tell me this does not actually look like Ollie as a baby. How cute is that? I had to send five photos of me and five photos of Ollie. He's actually got his hair and like his little cute eyes and his little nose. It's so cute. You guys need to do it. And then I think, is this, I think that's the boy. And then I think that's the girl. Oh, I could just, oh my God, I love them. It actually looks like how I'd imagine it. I mean, I've always imagined blonder, but I mean, I'm dark. So it, it maybe would outweigh, but I'm sorry. That actually looks like Ollie as a, like if you did a cartoon baby Ollie. Oh, 
it made me be like, oh, that's so cute. Anyway, I'm actually... Oh my god, guys, these, this girl just messaged me, Laura. These beach bags in Primark that I said I love, they're only £5 now. If you're going on holiday, run to Primark and get those. Oh, love you guys. Anyway, gonna jump in the shower, gonna wet my hair because I didn't wet it last night after being in the sea. It felt horrid, so I'm just gonna let it, um, I'm gonna wash it and then just let it dry. I think I might put it up in a bun tonight. I think I might put it up in a bun tonight anyway, so I might even put it up with a hair mask on. But I'm gonna jump in the shower. It's 20 to seven, so time to get moving. And then I think, I haven't worn this, but I really wanna wear the Zara skirt that I got, you know, the black one. So I think I'm just gonna wear that and then, um, oh well, I've got holiday outfits for next year, so I don't have to buy so much next year. So it's not a bad thing. We always knew I'd overpack a little bit, even though I'm always like, I am not an overpacker, girl. <laughs> you are. So let's jump in the shower um, and then I will come back and spend our last night in Turkey together. We don't go home, I think I've said till like, eight tomorrow so we've got the whole day but we'll probably just like pull it up as late as, late as possible go back to my mum's um hotel room shower get picked up eat and then get picked up go to the airport and i can't wait to see the dogs i was on facetime to james yesterday and um, because i said like oh before you leave will you just facetime and um, like show me them because i miss them so much and frankie was like looking for me and sash was like asleep and then she woke up and she was like just like this at the camera <laughs> i miss them so much they're gonna be so excited to see us so I feel like she, Frankie, Sasha won't care, but Frankie gets very like annoyed. Like when you leave, like she, then she becomes really obsessed with whoever looks after her. So like she, James and Katie said, like she's been obsessed with them, like won't leave them alone, like been following them. And now obviously like they've gone, like she's going to be like, Nan, who are you? And where's my sister? And where's my mum? And where's my brother gone? Um, so I feel like she's going to be so excited. I feel like she's going to lose her head. But then she'll be annoyed. She'll be excited to see me for like thir maybe 30 seconds, two minutes. And then she'll be like, bitch, where did you go? <laughs> anyway. Oh, did I show you the butterfly? How cute this bikini has a little butterfly. Imagine it giving me a tan line of a butterfly. Would be low-key cute though. I mean, I do look more tanned on camera. I feel like I should give myself more credit. Um, anyway, let's shower because else I'm going to be late and I'm going to get told off. See you guys in a little bit. Okay, I have just jumped out the shower and done my skincare. While I let all that sink in and my brows dry, I thought I'd run through products that I brought for holiday that I thought actually worth it, like holiday essentials that I think are worth the hype. So starting with the Laneige, you probably know I was going to say this, but honestly, for £20, for the pot you get, I've had this for like two weeks and honestly put it on multiple times a day. I've barely even touched the surface. It's obviously got no SPF in, but throughout the day, just to hydrate the lips, incredible. Secondly, we've got the Malibu Lip Cares. Again, I think for the price, you won't find anything better. You get three flavors. I think I got it from Home Bargains. They sell them in a, like those sort of like um, drugstore shops. It protects the lips. I have really sensitive lips, which I think I've said. So um, yeah, it's important for me to you know, Bondi Face SPF, cannot recommend enough. I used the tinted one, I've just put that one on, but I've also been using this one in the day. It goes in really nicely, it doesn't leave a white past. I feel like my face hasn't burned once. I always get like a red nose, hasn't happened this time at all. It's really protected my face. And yeah, I've reapplied it a couple times a day worth the money for sure and i think like six pound bum bum cream i don't know whether i'd say it's worth the hype but for the little set you get so you get the i'll show you so what you get in the little set i got it off look fantastic you get it in this like 
little pink and um, yellow little bag which i've been using as like my pool bag for all my essentials so you get the spray you get the mini cream and then you also get the shower gel and i've just used the shower gel i feel gorgeous my skin has not been dry this whole holiday and i've been using a combination of this and this haven't peeled obviously i haven't burnt but like i haven't peeled my skin hasn't felt dry this again is definitely one that i'd recommend you guys get it's the garnier intensive seven day goes in really nicely i feel like i'm not sticky afterwards like i really dry however this would not recommend to a friend so this is a St. Moritz Daily Tanning Moisturiser. Maybe it was how I applied it. I did my I did my full body. My arms, perfect. Here, fine. My back went a bit patchy, but I'll let them off with that because I did it myself. So I was a bit like, but my legs went so streaky. And again, it might have been the way I applied it, but I mean, I might give this another go when I'm home, but I put this on a couple of nights ago and my legs were so streaky. So I haven't put it back on, but smells nice doesn't dry super fast but i would probably say get the garnier one if you're gonna get one you know the one that's in this bottle but orange i would just say stick with what we know girls i feel like this is a no hair products the vodas and um, sun soothe brain i've also got the mask somewhere i don't know where it's gone but i also got the hair mask and i wish i could show you guys you will know what it is it's just a little part really good again my hair has not felt dry obviously it felt salty so but that's from being in the sun and i did also get this one the solde Janeiro milky leave-in um conditioner and this one is also good for like just the scent more so i have reached more for this one but if you're looking for something to like make your hair smell nice would recommend Way Hair Royal, for sure, you girlies need this. This is honestly like one of my Holy Grail products. Obsessed with this always. This is a St. Moritz product that actually I would recommend. This is the Prime and Glow Face Tan Serum. Again, in shade light. And you can use this for, what does it say? It can be used on its own under makeup for a radiant finish or on its own to give you an actual glow. I've been putting this on in the mornings and in the evenings under my makeup when I go to sleep. And like, it's given me a nice glow i wouldn't say you put it on and instantly feel like you've got color but it definitely does give you a glow um, and other than the garnier face tan serum which i just lost throughout the week that's pretty much i think everything that i've loved um also have been loving this but i wouldn't say that that's a holiday essentially it's just the kylie eye cream but yeah that garnier one is so good it literally drips down your face it goes in so nice it doesn't leave you with a white cast um but yeah I, I just lost that around the pool i think so those are pretty much my holiday faves anything else i would say that's probably it but i did also get a ring last night which i haven't shown you so i'll show you that once i'm ready but it's like a marmorous stone i think it's called and it changes colors so it's a bit like a mood ring but throughout the so i, I think it has seven colors so it goes from sorry it goes from like a brownie orange to a green to a blue to a pink and then a hot pink and the hot pink is gorgeous and it's all to do with like what light is on it so literally if you walk from like the room to the balcony it changes color and um, i don't know how you get the pink light i don't know if it's like i don't know i haven't obviously worn it outside yet but i'll definitely be wearing it at home because it's stunning i got like a little um it's got like it's like a circle stone and then it's got like little stones around it it's honestly beautiful and they also had the matching bracelet in the jewelers um which was like it was like 110 pound my mom said you bought me for my birthday but i was like oh like it is nice and um, i was obsessed with it but we didn't have that much cash and my mom was like i'll bite you but i was like oh no i feel bad but the the bring was like 30 i think he said 35 to start with, but i got him down to 30 so it's gorgeous it's stunning i feel like it's it's gold too so i feel like it's something that i'll definitely keep because i really like to like invest in jewelry staples that i like really love and i love like a sentimental piece so i thought this is a nice like memory of my family holiday i haven't been a mum for so many years and yeah i've really enjoyed it so i feel like we all get to that age where we stop going with our family for whatever reason but I feel like especially when you've got siblings it's actually so nice to go away with them um and yeah we just stopped going because we were like oh like, we want to go on our own or like go with our friends or 
um, whatever. So yeah, it's been really nice to go back with the fam. So I'm going to finish getting ready, put you guys on charge, and then I will come back when I am ready. My face is burning, well, my lip's burning here. Like I've burnt, I think, like above my lip and oh, it's a bit sore. I could feel it burning and I didn't have the Malibu in my bag with me at balls, so. Peace to that, peace and love sisters. See you in a little bit. Guys, this is my outfit tonight. I got the Zara skirt, it made it out of the bottom. Oh, that was embarrassing. Um, yeah, the Zara skirt made it. I thought for a second she wouldn't be, but the top is Stradivarius, meeting them at the outside bar. Skirt is Zara. Shoes are actually Primark, and bag is also Primark. And I'll show you guys my ring, it's stunning. Would you hold my phone, please? Okay, this is it. So it's currently like a purple colour. Dinner, I forgot to put Joseph on, and when I tell you, can you smell me? I can smell me whenever I move. I just got the chips, I'm not really that hungry, and the food isn't the best here. But I also got a little sunset mocktail and water. Holly had like random things, but I just don't really feel that hungry. Bit turkey, of rice, and chicken. I have. Turkey, rice, and chicken. Was the turkey nice? Archie's got some of that turkey too. I just yeah, really don't fancy fair, it. Yeah, it was. I don't like turkey. It's better than what you get on a Christmas dinner. Yeah. It was more like beef, wasn't it? Like, yeah. I wish there was vinegar though, that's one thing. We are walking down the street for the very last time have a little walk around and then hopefully find like a bar or somewhere to have a drink. Me and Mum are both in orange today. Hi Very guys. Cute. Hi guys. And um, so I'll show you over there. Obviously I'm going to get in a tattoo. Hour, my friend. An hour? Huh? That took an hour? No, no, it's my friend. An hour. Oh. Okay. He doesn't know what it comes to. We got it. Banana split. morning besties well last night took a little bit of a turn <laughs> i'm just gonna skip to the clips you can watch and i'll be here waiting to chat with you afterwards hey guys we think we've picked i'm so scared <laughs> Which one do we think we're thinking? I see. I do actually like that one now, but I've always said I just want minimal, so. <laughs> You're a turn. You gotta hold his hand now too. <laughs> you were a really good sport. I can't believe it. I literally been shocked. I keep looking at it. So me and Ollie always said we wanted to get matching tattoos. Like we've always been like, and I've always said like the only tattoo I'll ever have is like a matching one. Like I'm not, you know, I'd only ever have something that was meaningful. Um, and then Ollie really wanted one last night, and he's like, you know, you did say if we went away, you'd maybe get one. And I was like, true. So. Yeah, Ollie got two tattoos, but I got one and I can't believe really it. My nan's gonna kill me. Nan, I'm so sorry. <laughs> Can you believe it? Because I actually am in shock. Like, I keep looking at it thinking, I kept waking up in the night, being really nervous about the fact I had it because I was like, does it look okay? And I kept putting my flash up, and I'm like, yes, it looks okay, but I love it. And I got red, and I always said, like, I'd love it in red too. Um, and then like, I was just so overwhelmed in the shop because I like, was picking the font, picking the size, like, picking where I wanted it, all of that. Um, I hadn't even thought about the red, and then he was like, 
do you what colour do you want? And I was like, and I was like, Joey, red. And I was like, red. I thought I'm so glad he asked me and didn't just put black in and do it. I mean, black would have been fine, but um, yeah. And I knew there was a reason I could save this cherry bikini till the end of the holiday. So it goes so nicely. And I wanted it somewhere where like no one can really see, other than like if I was in a bikini. Like I didn't want one like on my arm, on my the back of my arm, like. I don't know, anywhere like that. Like, I wanted something that just, like, you know, me and Ollie can see. Um, and then, obviously, the bikini looks really cute. Um, and it shows, which I didn't want it to be hidden in the bikini or, like, half partially showing. So, I'm actually so happy with it. I got it so small, so simple. I think literally I got, like, three and a half centimetres, one centimetre. Like, it's tiny. Not, probably not even one centimetre. It is honestly tiny, but it's so cute. I love it. So, what's that TikTok I'm trying to remember? It's like, if you don't like tatted girls, then take me off the roster. <laughs> um, and Ollie got his granddad's name here, which is actually super meaningful, and I'll tell you for why. His granddad had the exact same tattoo that he'd done himself when he was younger, and like you couldn't quite read it like at the end of his life, but like he knew that it said Tony. And Turkey is where Ollie has always came on family holidays because his nan and granddad had an apartment here. Um, so like all of his best special memories are all here. So I was like, it is, and he's always wanted something for his granddad, but not quite know what, what to have. Um, and then he was like, what if I just have the same tattoo? And I was like, it's so special because you're in the country where like, like when we're here, like Ollie talks about his granddad and like things he did with his granddad, and like it's really cute. So I was like, I feel like it's super special. And then we, um, then he decided to have Jay on his room finger. She's here, which I will show you guys, but he's just outside um, on the balcony. So, yeah, we're tatted, matching tattoos, baby. We, I didn't want one on show, so we made the deal. Initial on show, name, here. That's the way to do it, ladies. Oh, yeah. you come and show the vlog, your tattoo. We're really tired guys, we didn't get until two. And show them the other one. <laughs> I'm gonna laugh me so hard. One sec guys, let me focus it. I love that one. I think it's perfect to so, like when you when you've got your arm like that, it's just there, isn't it? It's lovely. Tony is my granddad, by the way. I've, I've just told them the story, yeah. yeah. But it was really special. Um, so it's our last day, so that's what we got up to on our last night. Crazy. Um, we also got dancing in the um, the little bar last night, doing the Macarena, doing the cha-cha slide. It was a fun night. Um, but yeah, we didn't get in until so late. Like, it was gone, was it gone two o'clock? It was like half one. We got to the, t the tattoo shop about 11 and... He just fucking loved smoking, didn't he? Yeah, he loved to fag. And like, we were in there for probably half an hour before the tattoo art artist was like ready for us. So we were like picking fonts. We met the sweetest girl, didn't we? Yeah. How lovely. She was called Erin and she worked there and she actually works at our hotel as well. And she's from Turkey and she's 22. And we were talking to her, we followed each other on Instagram. I'll we'll put a little selfie that we took on the screen. It was just, it was, she made, the, like she held both my hands like Ollie was vlogging. She was like so lovely. She made the experience like really nice and she was so lovely and kind. And we're gonna go and see her at lunch because she works in the restaurant at lunch. So we said we'd go and see her and say hello. So yeah, um, that's what we got up to. That's the update for now. I'm just gonna finish wrapping up this room and then we're gonna take the cases down to my mom's room. Then we're gonna grab some breakfast and then we are going to head to the pool for our last day. We don't leave until like tonight. So we've got a whole pool day, which is really nice. Um, so I will just finish this and then I will see you guys down there. And we actually might make breakfast today for the only third time on the trip. Third? Yeah. No, because we went on the boat trip day two, if you remember. Oh, yeah. But that was by force, that wasn't by choice. This is it in natural light. Oh, I actually love it, it looks so nice. I don't know where my boobs have come from in this bikini. Someone's obviously been eating a lot of food because... <laughs> so I thought I'd show you my mum's room because we just come to drop the bags off. Um, it's so much bigger than ours. I mean, I'll just give you a scan because all the stuff's in it, but it's a big room. Then the bathroom and then my little brother's room. 
but the balcony view is everything. Look at that, it's so much better than ours. It's gorgeous. They're on like the top floor in these like annexes, so the roofs are like this, but how beautiful is that for you to wake up to every morning? Going to do water sports, guys. On the phone because I get the camera safe. What? They've got pedlos. Have they? Oh, that's what I love. Oh, yeah. Yeah, we're going to go on water sports. You know what I'd like to try as well, that paddleboard. Yeah, I'd like the paddleboard. You never know, I Oh my god guys, that wiped me out. Let's get away from the music. Oh, chocolate cake. Was there any pancakes or not? Uh, yeah. Pancakes. yeah, I'm gonna get those. I really like the pancakes guys. Hello, can I please get pancakes? Two please. Thank you very much. Oh my god, guys, it threw. Did you go off first? No, Archie went off first, then I went off because we went on the edge thinking, like, we'll let the Ollie and Andy go in the middle, being bigger. Um, but it doesn't work like that because whoever's on the edge just falls off. So, what would have happened if we would have got back in the same positions? You guys probably wouldn't have fallen off unless I tried to throw us all off. We were close. They yeah. It was so hard. And then, obviously, you smack the water, and then you just left there, aren't you? Until they come back round to get you. It was so rough. And then, like all the salt gets in your in your eyes, my eyes were stinging at the end. And then they say, "Stand up for a photo." You can't stand up unless you were just falling. This is what we got. It's about four o'clock. We're just chilling by the pool. Hello, guys. Checking in from the airport. It is currently 11 o'clock. Our flight's in about 50 minutes. I picked myself up a Starbucks um, frappuccino, the caramel. I really love these ones, and I've literally had no nice coffee. So, before I get this, I'll just got a iced tea. Um, and this is essentially the end of the turkey vlog so I hope you guys really enjoyed it I will be back next week with regular scheduled programming weekly vlogs hauls, all of that so if you did enjoy this video don't forget to stick around but I've honestly had the best holiday me and Ollie were just talking like I feel like you get to an age where you feel like going on holiday with your family is not necessarily like cool and like we definitely were like oh my god we can go on holiday on our own and that's what we did for so many years and like going back on holiday with our family it, I don't know it's just like a reminder not that we needed reminding but just a just a reminder that like family is everything and we're just so grateful to have had the best holiday so what did you get? Is it at the kiosk? It says that there, if you spend over 30 euro, that you get free Wi-Fi. I don't want <laughs> so yeah, I hope you guys did really enjoy. I don't know if I mentioned the hotel we stayed at, but it's Ideal Prime Beach Marmaris. Um, it was fine, like good vibes, just food. But I feel like all-inclusive food is always a little bit like that anyway. But yeah, we had the best time. We're sad to leave my mom and everyone, but I'm hoping to have the best week. And yeah, I'll see you guys very soon. Let me know what content you want to see for the rest of the summer. Let me know where you're going on holiday. Airports are a cool place, but I just want to go home now. So it's going to be a long night. I can't wait to get home and see the girls. So I love you, and I will see you in my next one. Don't forget to subscribe. Goodbye.